All right, welcome everybody. Welcome back. Uh, so I'm here with Austin again. What's up, guys? Again? Yeah, it's Austin. And uh, we thought that really getting into the Christmas spirit, with mm -hmm. it being December and all, we would play basically the most Christmassy game that I have. That's one I could think of. Yeah, yeah. which which just so happens to be this one. Because, uh, do normal. It's nothing crazy. Yeah, because, you know, he's, uh, I don't want to spoil anything that they're about to say. But he's looking for his father. For my uh, and there's there. snow. I'm not gonna make So, like, family and snow, what else? What could be... Oh, they're missing his presents. Yeah, really. Yeah. Life before I was even in it. So when he sent me a letter a few days after Mom's funeral, it was the first I'd ever heard from him. Pity he was dead. Like, ever. Writing from beyond the grave must be a genetic habit in my bloodline. Really? His letter contained Do you a key, get letters from dead parents all the time or something? I the dead don't have much use for absolution, so I turned yeah. to his prophetic house in which he Hey, uh, Uncle Steve's been dead, dead for, for like, ever, right? Is he sending me checks? Yeah, he sent me a letter again. Can we get on that? I thought the psychic said that was supposed to stop. I don't know how I feel about this. Why does UPS deliver this? It's a little fucked up. Isn't it? I went as he knew I would. I discovered that despite strange. the evidence, he'd been legally declared dead almost 30 years ago. And so the legally. Wow. Legally. Talk about, so yeah. Had, Talk about a, 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 a Twilight Zone thing, and wa walking into a bank. Hey, so I have a deposit box for my dad. But that was his What's your dad's name? Steve Harvardson. <laughs> which is the first legitimate name that I can think of. <laughs> Steve Harvard. The university oh. I taught at that, world -renowned that can't be. Physics and Why? Linguistics. Steve Harvardson's been dead for 30 years. But I'm only 20. Oh, yeah. Right. Talking about a twist there. Yeah, my dad had been dead for 30 years. Which is weird, because I am 14. He has been dead for, for twice as long as I have been alive. I don't even know how that's possible. Freezers. Freezers? Freezers. Yeah. disappeared three decades ago. I'm not gonna explain, but freezers. Lonely nights and turkey basters is all I'm gonna say. What it was that I was leaving behind. We landed on a strip of ice a few feet wide, and within minutes I was pulling away. That doesn't sound safe. Yeah, no. Beginning the 12 hour journey that would lead me into my past. Isn't this guy British? Why is he saying feet? I know, right? Meters. A few meters. Yeah, a few, it was only a few kilometers wide. Because <laughs> I know metrics. Yeah. Uh. No, what I think is weird is so he flies halfway across the road world, not the road, sorry. He flies halfway across the world, takes a 12 hour boat ride for a letter. His dad, who's been dead for 30 years, he never even known, sent him. So, a legit conversation he had with his wife was hey, babe, you know, I know we're busy being alive and having lives and stuff like that, but. You know, do you mind if I put that on hold? Because my dad sent me a letter uh, to go to this bank. And then when I went to the bank, the bank said he was dead for 30 years. And in his box was another letter that basically said to disregard everything else and forget that he'd ever sent me a letter. And well, I know what, what you're do? thinking. What do you do? That sounds crazy. But you know what? <laughs> Fuck it. I'm going to go on an adventure. Here you go. Adventure. So, that's like the weird, that's the thing I can't get behind about with this game, is I'm all about curiosity, but it just comes to the point, right? Like, I'd get, I would do, you know, I would, I would check it out, but after, you know, flying and then a 12-hour boat ride, is that actually Jack Daniels, or is that like Jack? Jack Angus? Jack, An Jack. yeah, Jack, Jack. Jack Annuals. Jack Annuals? <laughs> wow. The they didn't even stand. try. He's just Jack Ant. <laughs> Here, let's see. I don't like Jack Angle's whiskey. I'm not a huge fan of it. Wait, let me see if I can get in the bucket. Yeah, and he shoots Kobe. Oh, oh hey, you got some in there. <laughs> yeah, I got a couple pieces in there. Wait, is that Ample suit? Oh, wait, yeah, is that Ample suit? Let's check. Oh. The rolling. I can't. Oh, oh God. Oh, oh, wait. What about this? What is that? Yeah, right. I know. Is it the Stuff is the, it the Amble soup uh, that was drawn by the famous artist Andy Borhall? Not to say that he's boring. It just was a generic, non-licensed name that I could 
Oh, oh did I get it? Oh, so you tipped it over. Oh, Bummer. whatever. I was the shadows better. are amazing in this, though. I know, right? This I think this game's, like, not that recent, either. No, no, no. No, oh, well, I can't forget this. Okay, uh, what do I have to do? There's a key. I got a flashlight. A torch. Yeah, if he's British, wouldn't he call this a torch? Yeah. Do British people? I don't, I don't know British people. I don't want to just make assumptions. But, I'm pretty sure. My ignorance is telling me that I don't think they call it that. The number came to out 2009. 2009? Did you just yeah. look that up on your phone? I did, I just did. That is... I'm going to have to take that with me. You know what actually my biggest problem with this game is? Mm. Uh, the lack of controller support. Mm. Uh, more than anything. Just to describe the scene for you, we're sitting on my bed, uh, and... Uh, I we just have the keyboard and the mouse here on the bed. I have a I have a really neat loot crate uh, mouse pad here, mm -hmm. and it's Austin's. Uh, and uh, we're just we're just sitting here playing it on the bed. Yeah, chilling up. Also, where does the boat go? Well, we've been walking. I I, I think I was talking over it. Oh, okay. but we were walking for a while. Um, so not only did he take. Like a boat ride to get here, and no snowmobiles, a, right? No. Uh, an airplane, twelve-hour boat ride, an airplane. Uh, he also walked in the snow a whole bunch, and that's nice. Obviously, that's just the wind. Obviously, no, nothing. I apparently have not. Oh, can't get in. Ice is too thick. No shit, Sherlock. Well then, what to do? I guess we'll just go home. Sorry, yeah, guys. Yeah, seriously. It. Yeah. Well, that's it, uh, that's it everybody. Uh, maybe next time we'll play something just a little bit longer than uh, Penumbra Overture. I can't believe this is so positively reviewed on Steam. Five minute game. Yeah, I know. What game was that that just got in trouble? Uh, it was like a puzzle game or something, and. Apparently, it was supposed to be one of those games. It's like, oh, this is. Is this the right button? No, oh, it's R. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, some get fancy. Sure. If you if you hold T, it holds the camera in place, so you can you can Smash bash that things. thing. There you go. Get out of here. Ooh, I gotta spin it. That's working out well. If you need more leverage. Oh, there you go. There you go. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out if it was leverage or the pad here. It's just probably leverage. Uh, yeah, there was a game. It was uh, it was like one of those really hard, you know, like very. I'm not gonna say it was Dark Souls, but it's like one of those games because it's very different. I think it was like a strategy, like survival game or something. Mm -hmm. And uh, and apparently, from what I was reading, it the the guy had only made like the first level. Where he'd made, like, the first six levels, and then, like, the third one was supposed to be super hard, when in reality it was actually impossible to beat, and the other levels weren't completed, and he oh, was just selling so it's it. to get people to... Yeah, and he was just selling it as, like, a completed game or something. Oh, my God. Or it was mostly done, it just didn't have the last level built, or... And, and like, he got, like, a lot of trouble. Oh, shit. Wait, uh, so we need our torch. I got oh, a glow stick. Go. What do they, they call that? I think British we probably people. just call it a glow stick. I need my bright stick. Yeah, I need my, I need my Lumi stick. <laughs> <laughs> that is, uh, that's awful. It's I'm crazy, sorry. Crazy British people. Yeah, my my horribly insensitive and obviously not good British the thing person. Thing in this uh, universe, everything that's useful glows. Well, I mean that's good because it's it's dark in here. Mm -hmm. I tried to loot that for ammo. Thank you, Fallout. Not to date this or any, not to, not to spoil, I don't, I don't oh, dumb, 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 okay, is everything okay there, chief? Yeah. Ooh, 
Ooh. Oh, I think I gotta drag it. All right. Very quiet shelf. Old, I know, right? That didn't even make any noise, though. Oh, oh, it's made of balsa wood. Yeah, you think so? Yeah. I was trying to run away. <laughs> yeah, it's it's alive. It's actually possessed. Let's see. Notes. Ah, uh, no notes still. To-do list. There is some ward ceiling hole in the wall that I might be able to break through. Uh, that's, I guess, with the Too hammer. Too we don't have a shiny metallic... Hammer? Yeah. Was that what you were going to say? Were you going to say hammer? Kind of less obvious. Whoa. Well, you gotta, you that's gotta. That's a teeny ass hammer. You gotta, you gotta swing it too. That's the worst part. Like, like, look, 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 look. You can't just click it. Look at me. Like, you gotta. You're not even looking. You can't click it. I'm looking. Click it and then. Yeah. This is oh, real. There you go. Could you like, especially because I have to do the cross swipe and then pull it forward? Could you imagine this in VR? Oh, that'd be amazing though. I got my hammer of righteousness to protect me. My plus four hammer of righteousness. Don't you like Ooh. Oh. Yeah, I don't think so, sir. How about. Hey, you guys. What are we. Yeah. Yasa, what do you think you're supposed to put in that? <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's a dick in a box. What is that? Well, I think <laughs> not yet. Someday soon, maybe. Can I break this? Little bastard crate. Ooh, ah, you can. You go. Oh, I gotta put the. Awesome! I found the way out. Oh no! No, I'm just kidding. That's where we fell from. We're back in the front room. Did we? Yeah. Does uh, not look. Oh, we fell. I didn't oh, know but that. there's a pipe here. Ah, there steel rod. So we did have to put a rod in there. <laughs> hey, that's what the game said, not me. Oh yeah, just stick it in there all nice. We got hurt from doing that. Did we? No. Do I have to, oh, can I? Can what I... about the scary thing that's down there? Well, I don't think this game wants me to go anywhere else. There's so not any just, other. We should just stay in here. We'll just forever. stay in here. Yeah. Yeah, that's forever. It. We'll just, we'll just stay in here. All right, guys. Well, I guess we'll, we'll just, I'll just, take my hands up yeah that's it stay here that's it guys cheerio yeah no well, hey so <laughs> british people sarah i don't know british people actually 